You didn't do it right. You are not dead like me. Let's see what else you remember from your training. Try kicking those birds for warm-up.
you did it. Father and mother's children are already coming. Are you listening? Yeah! If you stay with me, they might hunt you down too. I know. There he is! Nap! We'll eat your butt on death in your skull! death! Try to resist, Gap. I'll try to open the gate. You're no brother of mine, no, Gap. Brother, no. You killed father and mother, you worthless cack. Put the burning girl. Are you okay? You were gone. 
down for a minute. I know you're tired, but they're bringing bugbirds to follow you. You have to get a gun before they get here. Oh, well, kill you. Uh, 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 
decided to follow me, Deirdre, because I wasn't going anywhere. So you were going to wait here? Till your million brothers and sisters got here and killed you? Get up, you Tef. We'll go into the beach or the woods, where we can hide. Away from Halston. I'm glad you came, Deirdre. Seems now it's my turn to follow you. Do you think your family will come after us? I'm sure of it. It's what I would do.
I hope our trail is harder is harder is hollow in the woods. By now Rimat must be up and telling your hundreds of brothers and sisters to come after us. Father mother had many children, but we are not hundreds. Oh, you're not hundreds. We're pretty safe then, huh? <gasps> What's that noise? He is one of the corwood of the free. One of those crazy people? Cack. If this place is full of Corwitz, I'd rather go back to Halston. They're not so bad. Look, he has his mind set on headbutting things, and nothing will change his mind about that. But why would he do that? Why not? Watch out! are not slaves of reality, so they can be insane. You almost seem to admire them. I was a Corwood of the Free. Nah, come on. It is true. This is where I've been most of this last month. So, was
Was it the Corwitz who made you kill Father Mother? Was that it? No, it's not like that at all. But what did you do here? What's so special about these crackpots? I don't get it. It's not easy to explain. I'll tell you what I can about the Corwitz I met. One of them was Erminia. Erminia peed on herself and starved to death anonymously. And that is what Erminia did. It, because Corwids are not slaves of their needs, of eating or sleeping. There was also Gabel. Gabel ate people, and that's just what he had to do. The Corwids are not slaves to morality or common sense. So, if I were like Anamasta, I would have let Gibel eat me. But I didn't feel I had to be eaten. 